Welcome back. Pride Month is still in full swing, and where better to celebrate than the iconic Castro Theater? They're hosting the 46th annual Frameline Film Festival, and Malou Nubla got a behind-the-scenes look. We are celebrating Pride today with a look at Frameline Film Festival's lineup this week. And we're taking you inside the beautiful and iconic Castro Theater, where you can see many of the films. The Frameline is the San Francisco International LGBTQ Plus Film Festival, which is the largest and longest running queer film festival in the world. The festival is going on now, and most of the films are being shown in the Castro District, a vibrant area full of shops, restaurants, and of course, the famous Castro Theater, which is celebrating 100 years after officially opening in 1922. Since then, in 1976, it became an historic landmark. There's just something about the beauty and the legacy of this building that adds to that feeling of community and sort of situates you in history. Timothy Pluger designed the theater, which has more than 1,400 seats. And the theater's ceiling has one of the last leatherette ceilings in the United States. I like me for me. I'ma be what I'ma be. This year, for Frameline 46, our theme is The Coast is Queer, because I am never one to leave a good pun on the table, but in all seriousness, we are witnessing a lot of physical and uh, legislative attacks on LGBTQ plus people in our country right now. And we really wanted a theme that spoke to this idea that in the Bay, queer stories will indeed always be celebrated and queer bodies will always be protected. And there's a great lineup of shows you won't want to miss. Last Dance is our centerpiece documentary, and we are super excited to, to host the world premiere of the film right here at the Castro Theater on 623 at 6 p.m. Last Dance chronicles the final performance of iconic drag queen and legend uh, Vincent DeFonte as Vincentos, who is also a local hero, having helped build the Tranny Shack legend. Oh my God, it's you. Oh it been God. like 12 years? You remember me? right? Yeah. I just can't picture myself without her. Sissy is a highlight of our Queer for Hear Fear horror collection, and we're going to be screening it at the New Parkway, also on 623 at 9 p.m. Sissy is a bloody, neon-fueled, glittery uh, reimagining of Stephen King's Carrie. You will laugh, you will be terrified, and you will not be able to look away from the screen. And get your bucket of popcorn ready for the finale. Our closing night offering is Francois Ozan's Peter von Kant. We are super excited to have this gender-swapped reimagining of the original Fassbender, The Bitter Tears of Petra von Kant, which is also screening at the Castro. In Peter von Kant, Ozan's titular character either seduces or is seduced by his latest muse. He uses this muse or is used by this muse for inspiration. This is a decadent, sexy, highly charged, tense film that just absolutely lights up the screen. There's nothing quite like seeing a film in the Castro during Frameline because our audiences are absolutely amazing. You never know, you could be sitting right next to, next to the filmmaker, you could be sitting next to the producer or the next big star. Frameline's Film Festival runs until Sunday, June 26th. There's also a streaming online encore that starts Friday and runs until Sunday. So check it out.